Good afternoon, everyone. Happy hump day. I am going into Boots at the moment. Oh, I want this open. My phone won't open. I want to just connect to the radio. Yeah, I'm going into Boots because I need to get purple shampoo and just like a couple of other bits like in there. Like I need new razors. I need to get some... What else do I need to put the window down? That's what I need to do. I need to get some purple shampoo, razors, deodorant, and kind of like another few bits and pieces of toiletries. And I can't find my boots card anywhere. I don't know where it is. And I know I have at least like 25 euro on it, which is really annoying. Yeah, so I can't use my boots card to pay for the stuff, which is really annoying. So yeah, that's not like the biggest issue, but you know the way, like when you have like 25 euro on your boots card, it will be just really helpful so i need to get my purple shampoo to tone my hair i haven't toned my hair extensions since i got them in a week ago and i generally will tone them like after i like kind of let my hair settle down like a couple of days after i get my bonds in they have to be toned because i've blonde hair and the color that i kind of get through my hair has like a bit of a tone through it like it's purple shampooed or well it's toner but it's kind of makes it a bit more silvery and then the like it cools down my hair and then the hair extensions are a bit too warm so they never ever ever match when I first get them in like my hair extensions I just need to tone them because I know somebody made a comment about that they're like your hair extensions do not match they never match when I first get them in because they need to be toned they're not like ridiculously unmatched but they just they're too warm and my hair is cool toned because like I said I get a toner in it anyway that's besides the point so the one I get is the Lee Stafford one which I'll show you it when I'm when I purchase the stuff from Boots but I absolutely love it because it's the best one at just lifting out any yellow tones from the hair extensions it's just great and then as well like as you're kind of like washing your hair and stuff it starts to go like a little bit yellow you know after time so it's nice to just kind of like freshen up Oh my god, I love this song. It's like I had like a playlist on my Spotify. I have so many playlists. And like one of the playlists is like my teens. And my teens just consisted of Eminem and 50 Cent. Because I was upset. I got no Legendary song. Last night we were listening to Shamillionaire. I dropped Ollie and her roommate Kira and they were over in the house last night. I dropped them home. And we had Shamillionaire on. This is rolling. I was like... This is like my youth. I just remember loving that song so much when I was younger. Absolutely adored it. Now what's going on here? What's the whole up traffic? It's ridiculously warm today. It's 25, 25 of overcast heat today. And I'm just like sweating and I'm wearing like a cropped hoodie. What was I thinking? What was I thinking? I was like, I need to put on something. I'm heading out the door and this was just like, clean on my bed. Wow, that car is burning oil in front of me. There's like a big black smoke fumes after coming out of it. Man, you better check the car, hon. Okay, so this is the line that I always get and this is the conditioner and the shampoo. These are also really good for like an instant run, but this is the shampoo that I get all the time. But they're really good for like a deep kind of toning and then the leave-in is great as well. And guys, for regular shampoo and conditioner, these are the ones I use. They're on real best range ever. I really recommend these, the shampoo and conditioner in particular, and the hair mask. I absolutely adore them. Oh, and they're on special in boots as well. How great. God, they've really expanded their pixie range. I absolutely adore this. Pixie's like one of my favorite brands. They always send me out loads of stuff. I'm so grateful to them, but they've expanded it. And the nip and fab range, they have loads in here. That glow tonic's one of my favorites, and I love that mud cleanser too. They're really good. And then that peel and polish is so nice as well. Oh, and if you're to get anything, the peel off mask brilliant and it just cleans your skin out oh it's just amazing and i love all their oils as well they've expanded the last and finish in rimmel that line i really like that foundation i haven't tried it in years and then this one's kind of dwindling away which is one of my favorites my god it's ferociously warm outside so i managed to get my proper shampoo so let's tone these bad boys. I really need to wash my hair as well. It's gone really greasy. So that's the shampoo. 
um, that I showed you in store and it's like the best one for toning blonde hair like there's nothing like it and then I just picked up deodorant because I was all out and this is the one I always get but I usually get the smaller bottle they didn't have any small ones in there because I just hate these big monstrosities I'm gonna go home now and do my well wash my hair wow the big 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 plans of the day I was gonna work today like um film videos I said that yesterday I just feel my hair so like greasy Ugh. decided that I just would actually prefer to vlog and I'm not gonna turn my entire channel into vlogs so just don't worry about that I don't know it's just suit me more to vlog I love vlogging and it's kind of like where I feel best and I just kind of was putting it off for so long because I didn't want to like talk about why I'd moved home and stuff and I don't know I was just kind of like putting off vlogging and now I'm just like so much happier vlogging and I just feel like it's where I'm happiest again like I just feel like this is the best part of my job it's actually vlogging and talking to you guys and just been real like I know it might seem a bit boring because I mean I am boring but I just think it's I don't know it's more authentic to what I do and like I love beauty and everything like that and I will obviously incorporate loads of beauty and stuff but it's not all of me and you know I'm I'm not one dimensional I'm not just beauty I kind of want to go to McDonald's and get yeah I want to get a strawberry lemonade why not I got my drink oh this has to be the best like summer drink the only thing mcdonald's really need to improve their straws like i know we're all in the paper straw business now but there's paper straws in i think it was burger king i had them in and they were just so much better like the paper straws in mcdonald's just end up getting all mushy and just ugh. And then everything starts getting stuck in the bottom of it. It's just really annoying. Whereas the ones in Burger King were not like that at all. They kind of had like more of a waxy. Listen to me talking about stuff that I, f I, I have no idea what I'm talking about. But they're just more of a waxy film on the ones in Burger King. And they don't go all slushy. This drink is like, oh, it's everything. If you haven't tried it yet, like, just do it. Go, do it. You'll love it. And so cold, I get brain freeze off it all the time. Okay guys, I'm just out of the shower and I toned my hair extensions so I feel like they look a lot closer to my actual highlights in my hair. So I have to go and dry my hair. I need to spray some of this in. I love like how I always spray this stuff in when I am vlogging and then I end up getting it on whatever top I'm wearing. Just run it through my lens. Oh, my hand's shaking. Um, this is the Revlon, the one, all in one. It's like one in ten. No, there's ten benefits to it. I love the smell of that one because it has like a coconut fragrance to it. But I think people have said like online that they find that the the one in the red bottle works better. I don't notice any difference with it. I just find that that one works perfectly fine. I need to go and eat. That's probably why I'm shaking. My blood sugars are a bit low. My God. And I wouldn't mind, but I've been eating so much lately, but not the best things. I did talk about that yesterday in a vlog because I know so many people are like, can you please do like what I eat in a day? Like what a nutritionist eats in a day? And I was like, you would hate to see what I'm actually eating in a day now that the summer is here because I just feel like I'm eating so much crap here so i really need to clean up my diet and get back out running as well i haven't ran in like well i haven't run in like a week but maybe more i don't know it's been a while i need to get back to my three days a week running because i just i just miss it i miss the exercise and i'm not eating great and like the summer is just not doing wonders for me i always like eat better in the winter it's really weird because a lot of people say that they eat worse in the winter because they're eating like for comfort and warmth and stuff and i actually find it much easier to eat better in the winter than in the summer somebody else asked me a question on my blog i just read the question before i got into the chair i was like oh i'll address that now when i get out oh yeah vlogging in public someone was like how do you find vlogging in public do you find it really really hard or like did you find it hard at first or how does it feel and uh, my answer to that is i don't care <laughs> i really don't mind i don't think there's like an issue with like vlogging in public like if someone's looking at you weird like because you're vlogging in public that's fine because I mean it's not common that you would see people doing that but I also think like I'm not going to see them again like to be fair like if I'm in town like I'm hardly going to see some of the people that you know I'm in pennies vlogging around and I'm not I'm not going to see them the only time I ever feel a bit uncomfortable is if like you're vlogging in a shop and like maybe they're kind of like why is she vlogging in the shop and like what's she doing and if I'm looking at clothes and stuff or like when I was in boots there a while ago that's the only issue I ever have because I'm just worried like maybe the staff or like the security or something are kind of like 
we don't want you vlogging in the shop like and if that's the case it's never happened but if that was the case I just wouldn't do it but people in the public looking at me vlogging I don't really mind like I mean if they think it's weird that's fine Um, I don't think it's weird because I suppose I've been doing this job for like six plus years so it's kind of normal to me I'm not really sure if the person was asking me that because they want to get into vlogging but if that's why they're asking I would just say like just step out of your comfort zone go for it don't worry too much about what other people are thinking um while you're vlogging because realistically you're more than likely not going to see them again and if they are people that you know and they're uncomfortable with vlogging like oh my god it's getting really warm again if if you're around people that you know and they're uncomfortable with your vlogging or being in your vlogs then i would just say don't do that because some of my friends don't want to be in my vlogs and you know things like that and other people in my personal life don't want to be on camera and that's fair enough I just don't include them online but in public I just try not to like get too many people in the background or something or you know if they're looking at me weird like I don't I don't really mind <laughs> I don't really, it's not that I don't care I, I honestly just don't even think about it it's like second nature now at this stage like you just whip out the camera and you just talk to yourself in public and if people think that you're strange that's fine because I am a little strange but that's okay too Hey guys, I'm such a disaster. I completely forgot about ending the vlog and I'm just actually getting ready for bed right now. I'm brushing my teeth and washing my face and the usual. Um, so I said I would like end tonight's or today's vlog in the bathroom because why not? I told you guys I was using some of the new Penny's products, so like their cleanser and stuff and I'm actually really enjoying it. So I'm going to do like a proper breakdown video of those products from pennies because I think it'd be more additional if I actually talk about them in a whole video like where I just say oh I tried them for, for a week or whatever I'm currently trying them six days I think five days so I will do like a video maybe at the weekend or stuff but I have other kind of pennies stuff that I want to try skincare wise so I think once I've like tried loads of their skincare then I'll come back and do like a total video about all the penny skincare products and I think they have new stuff in at the moment so I might run in and I pick up a few other products that they have in their skincare line because I think that that would just be kind of fun because I'm actually really liking this and I know like some people in my comment section had said you know if there's more fragrance in it there's going to be more chemicals and it's going to be really bad for your skin and break your skin out but I feel like my skin is just really really good using it I don't notice any difference so like like breakouts or anything happening so I don't know maybe it's not that bad <laughs> Or maybe the fragrances are gonna they're gonna get me in the end all the chemicals all over my face For the most part I'm enjoying the products from pennies also the mask that I used last week One of my subscribers said the best way to use those masks Those real thick ones is to mix water in it so that it doesn't like peel off your skin because if you'd seen from the video the other day my skin was like It was like I was ripping my skin off or a layer off of it Anyway, I'm gonna go to bed and I will talk to all you guys in tomorrow's vlog because I said I'm gonna try and vlog for the entire week or as many days in the week anyway as I possibly can just for the hell of it. Next week we'll get back to the beauty videos because I'm actually really enjoying the vlog. So I hope you guys are too and from my comment section it seems that you guys are loving them. You're loving them so that really, really, really just that makes me feel great that you're actually loving them and enjoying watching them. So I'll talk to all you guys in tomorrow's video or the next day's video. Bye.